Well, today we learned the names of the two people from Knoxville killed in a plane crash in Middle Tennessee. A spokesperson for Giles County Emergency Management confirmed the victims were Jenny Blaylock and her father, James Buck Blaylock. 10 News reporter Olivia Daig spent the day learning more about Jenny and her father. Delta traffic, Debonair, 901 Juliet, departing now. Uh, Jenny zero and her dad, Buck, had a special bonding activity. Flying this 1965 single engine plane as father and daughter. I decided to take my dad up and um, just kind of let me mess with the autopilot some more. Jenny had a YouTube page where she used the alias Tennessee Fly Girl, sharing her travels and behind the scenes of what she loved to do. She also was the owner of a luxury remodeling company. According to Flyware, Thursday morning they took off from Knoxville Downtown Island Home Airport. Giles County EMA says witnesses called to report the crash around noon Eastern time Thursday. My wife seen the plane coming over and crash into the hillside over. Authorities arrived on the scene about 10 minutes later. Friday morning, we learned their names. The FAA and the National Transportation Safety Board are investigating. In a statement to WBIR, the Blaylock family told us they are thankful for the community support to the family during an unimaginable loss. They also say they feel comforted they met their savior together and ask the community for prayers. In Knoxville, I'm Olivia Daig. Jenny Blaylock owned a local company, Plantation Reclaimed Incorporated. Right now, the FAA and the NTSB are evaluating the pilot, the aircraft, and the operating environment of that flight.